Hey, what's up? It's Drew Reagan at Impact Strength and Performance here in Bellevue, Washington. Check us out at www.goimpactstrength.com. Last week, I talked about the importance of protein uh, in regards to burning fat and how that happens. Now, um, big proponent for high protein diet. Um, you know, really important. You get your cruciferous vegetables. I'm talking dense fibrous greens, kale, spinach, you know, broccoli, asparagus, all that good stuff. Um, staying hydrated, you know, the basic nutrition principles and tenets of having a healthy lifestyle, eating for energy and performance, and simultaneously trying to burn fat. Now, that's all great. I love that. I, I try and do that every single day of my life. Um, but what I've found to be the easiest way to burn fat and live a, a, an optimal lifestyle is through intermittent fasting. Now, intermittent fasting uh, isn't for everyone, right? If you have any particular medical conditions, uh, if you're diabetic, any heart conditions, um, you know, definitely go get cleared by your doctor if you want to pursue an intermittent fasting program. Um, if you're pregnant, all studies have ever been done on adults. So if you're under the age of 18, I don't recommend it either. Um, but for those who are looking to burn some fat and get in great shape, I think intermittent fasting is a great program that can benefit you. Intermittent fasting isn't a juice cleanse of one week or anything like that. It is a period of anywhere from 17 to 24 hours, sometimes a little bit longer, where you're cutting out food. Uh, kind of crazy, the biggest and hardest part for a lot of people is just getting over that, that learnt response of hunger and dealing with being hungry. Um, but there are some tremendous benefits, and I've, I've found this out through tons of research, pouring over tons of articles and, and books, all on this stuff, and also just participating and experimenting with intermittent fasting myself. Uh, just last month, and uh, a group of uh, 10 boot campers, there was an average of about 9, nine to 10 pounds of fat loss, 3% body fat reduction in 19 days with this uh, intermittent fasting program we used. I'll go into more of that a little bit later. But just kind of wanted to cover three of the biggest reasons intermittent fasting is so effective. First of all, uh, decreased insulin levels and uh, insulin sen and sensitivity. Uh, when we eat, insulin levels go up, right? The more sugar we eat, the more insulin is spiked. The more insulin spikes, the more we are in a constant fed state. And it's hard for our bodies to utilize fat as an energy source when we were constantly being flooded with sugar. So. When in a fasted state, it is easier to utilize fat as an energy source. Um, so that's, that's one thing. Uh, also, we want to have an increased insulin sensitivity. The more blunted our insulin sensitivity is, the easier it is to kind of get engaged in that vicious cycle of uh, low and, and high blood sugar crashes, feeling crappy. Uh, it gets kind of gnarly. And having a blunted insulin response uh, leads to pre-diabetic conditions, and that is why one, of, one out of every four people in America are either pre-diabetic or currently diabetic due to uh, a blended insulin response. Um, insulin regulates blood sugar, the more sugar in our bodies, our pancreas fries out, we're diabetic. Also, uh, increased li lipolysis and fat oxidation. So, lipolysis is uh, fat release. Oxidation is the burning of fat. In a fasted state, it is easier to utilize fat as an energy source and oxidize that, those free fatty acids and burn it. Uh, last but not least, increase growth hormone levels. Now, growth hormone is a very important hormone in our body. Um, you know, that's why bodybuilders and professional athletes have been injecting themselves in the butt with this stuff for decades because it leads to increased fat loss, building muscle tissue, uh, there's also supposedly been anti-aging effects associated with growth hormone, but it has been research tested and proven that fasting for up to 24 hours increases growth hormone in the body by up to, what was it? I wrote it down right here. Um, by, wow, by 600%, nearly sixfold. So, uh, the more growth hormone in our body, the easier it is to burn fat and simultaneously build muscle tissue. Because I know that is one of the biggest uh, issues with people who are opposed to intermittent fasting is the belief that you will lose a lot of muscle. But if done appropriately, 
If done effectively in making sure that you consume a high protein diet on non-fasting days and uh, participate in resistance training three to four times a week, you'll not only burn fat, but build lean muscle tissue. And that is, that is the goal of all diets, those two things. So uh, we are conducting a Lean 19 intermittent fasting program beginning Monday, May 28th. Uh, hit us up, uh, hit me up, Drew at GoImpactStrength.com if you're interested, or get me at, uh, get me at on uh, Facebook and let me know if you're interested. But Check out intermittent fasting, research it, it's the truth, and uh, have a great day.